Okay, now I'll teach you how to print, to install the rotary print device to print the bottle by the UV printer. So first we put the printing device on the table and we fasten the screw. Two, two screw at left side here, one, two, two, the hole here have a screw hole inside. And I must be sure the big hole, the big hole at the outside and my, the, the screw inside will not over. And also install the left side two screw to the machine. One, two screw to fasten it. And also fasten, fasten the another two screw here and here to, uh, to lock the rear, up down rear. And also, We can loosen the screw to adjust the, the gap, the distance between each, and put at the middle of the bottle to be sure the the three gear can match with the size, with good position, and then we fasten the screw here. and put the bottle on the top of the gear and then we go to the software to move up we can go software to move up the table but right now we must move a little bit by a little bit and not too fast because the upper limit sensor is not working when you print the, the the rotary printing media so so just we move up from the software by move up little by little bit three seconds by three seconds to move up and here we must pay more attention to this gap this metal cannot over this aluminum parts we just move little bit by little bit Then move it a little bit. Three seconds plus three seconds. Here, this gap must uh, keep the distance between the metal, these two metal, within two millimeter, or it will be hit the metal. Little bit more. Okay. So keep the gap like this. With a little bit uh, about two to three millimeter. Please be must be careful. If you if this metal move over the position, so the table still moving up. The table still moving up. So it will be damaged the table and the motor up down motor. So this is very important. This is very important. Must pay attention, more attention to to uh, the up down motion, or will be hit. Then we push down the images button, and we pull the carriage out of home position, and we check the gap between the print head and the media. Keep it as three to five, three to three to five millimeter. Like this gap, don't too big or be hit print head, and don't be too too the gap turn too big. If the gap too big, the printing cord is very no good. If the gap too too small, it will easily scratch the print head. So check the gap is at safety three to five millimeter, and not scratch the bottle. Then we release the emergency button and move the carriage back to home position. Then we go to the software to do some setting for print. So before we print the lottery print device, 
we must uh, take out the vanished print head. Because if we print on the bottle, the bottle, the bottle is bent, we can only print on the top and lost its print. So that so when doing printing, the vanished print head will not working. It's not a print. So we need to close the vanish printing jet ink. And also if we also if uh, if we print the bottle, the, the UV lamp, UV lamp, the UV light will be shining to the surface of the bottle and the, the light will be bent back to curing the the, the vanish print head to cause the the vanish print head clog. So we must take take out the vanish print head and then print the bottle. After we take out the vanish print head and be sure the gap between the media and print head is safety, then we go to the software to demonstrate. First, we must, uh, if we print on the bottle, we must uh, click on the round specific, specific function. And we need to open, close the choose by button. Close the, don't choose the last one, just only the, the button top like this. And here also go to the setting. Go to the maintain and nozzle adjust. And here, automatically choose one force for the nozzle. So if uh, your meter, the, the, the bottle with bigger size, so we can choose bigger, more nozzle to jet ink. So if the, your bottle, the size is small, so we you need to choose the less nozzle to print, print the ink with better quality. Normally, we recommend it by one force nozzle print, print like this. And also, we go to the calibration, and we need to be sure that the vanish, the first line, the first line is all kept by zero, without any parameter. Then we print, and also before print, we must be sure the the round size of the bottle the size is same as the the hairs of the job size then we print so the some important key feature is first we must be sure the flapped table up we are not over the first is must important must be sure the gap between the two metal have enough space about two to three millimeter and the gap between the print head the print head and the media also three to five millimeter and also take out the vanish print head to prevent clock by the strong UV line light and then the size of the the round size of the medium must the same as the head or more than the head of the printing job. So this is the, the printing procedure for print the rotary printing device. Thank you.